Hey guys, Laura here. Got Diabetes Ninja with me. Top of the morning. Got Daddy EMR with me. Hello! And uh, Microsoft's got this game now. Microsoft now owns Tony Hawk. I was curious which one of us was going to get to it first. I was like... Well, I'm the host, so it was always going to be me. That's true. And, I was uh, thinking of sniping. It was going to be a quick draw. We do not <laughs> support Activision Blizzard's bullshit, but they've kind of already got my money for this when it came out because um, I wasn't... Because I was in a moment of weakness. <laughs> and, uh, you know, fuck it. We're going to play some horse. Why not? Okay. So, So actually, player hey. one... Player one gets to be... Oh, Mr. Ed. <laughs> That's an old-timey reference. Uh, I need to hit X to join. Tony Hawk's second brother. And uh, I don't have my creative characters on here because... We're actually playing this on Ninja's profile. Ooh. So, I do not know any of these new skaters. At all. I guess I'll... Just to see what Nishimura is about. Alright. I used to be in... Like, I didn't skate good at all, but I used to be in, uh... Like, the culture, like, watching X Games and Remagazines magazines and shit back in the day. But probably 20... Probably 2009 was the last time I ever really indulged. So anybody who was at the past that point, I just don't know about. Um, I, I was never part of the scene. Hold on. Can you hand me that? We're not going to use horse, right? Nay! Alright, um... Oh, shit, no. I guess we're using horse. <laughs> sure. Alright. And Ninja goes first. Ninja's player one. So, yeah, you were never part of the scene? Oh, yeah, uh... I'm an overweight man. Oh, I should not try to talk while I'm skating. No, no, no. I, I need you to exclusively talk while you're skating. Yeah. Um. <clears throat> Alright, so I apologize for the radio silence uh, while I play. <laughs> I was that age where, like, you know, I didn't really quite know what identity I was going to have moving forward as an adult. I was still a kid, so it's like, oh, Tony Hawk's cool, right? I want to I wanna do that. I feel so, like our plan is he rehearsed everything he was going to say before this and played at the same time. I feel like he studied. <laughs> oh, I've studied Tony Hawk. I've, I've played enough of it. Um, but no, if you know what kind of day I've just had, you, you know I had no time to think about video games. Um, I've been gone all day from the yeah. house. So, full disclosure, I will not be able to match that score if you combine all the scores from all five of the runs that I do. No, I believe you. It's okay. Horse is a long word. Alright, so... That's a little short, but, you know. Plenty more layers of the alphabet. Alright, I definitely thought I meant you there, but I did not. But no, like, I was that age where it's like, oh, skateboarding looks cool, now I'm just gonna consume skateboarding, right? So, I bought a bunch of transport skateboarding magazines, uh... I had my parents buy me a skateboard from Walmart or some shit, and I... Uh, I actually got pretty confident, like, riding around, but I obviously never did anything like this, but... You know, you can actually uh, make an argument that I, I skated for a little bit. I do not know any of her moves. So. You are both... Huh. Oh, shit! Mm. Huh. There we go, land. He didn't land. All right, one forty three. What the shit? Okay, never mind. I'll do my best. Right. Well, I got a ho I'm a hoe now. I would not call you that because they're derogatory and offensive. Yeah, this is 2022. We don't we don't use that kind of sailor talk around here in that town. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, we may have whenever we were younger, but like we, you know... We had, Yarg! Uh, <laughs> Sorry, I heard sailor talk and I immediately wanted to be a pirate. 
Yeah, that, I'm glad that when people take a solo talk, that's their number one thought. Yeah. Oh, I don't understand what just happened. Mm, you you belled. I don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> so actually, I know Ninja doesn't have a lot of his life online, but I was online doing the years where you really had no business being seen in public. <laughs> so you can unfortunately find me saying a lot of uncool things. Please don't, though. But, uh, I think that's just part of, like, growing up, is realizing... Well, they hadn't... In... Oh! They had not quite invented berating people for not being woke enough yet at the time that you were doing that. Once, I think... Once the culture, like, switched and it was cooler to... What's weird, and, like, this is not cool. I'm not trying to glorify this the way some people have. Uh -oh. Um, what's weird, though, is that on most of the internet, if you were on forums, you actually got fucking ostracized for not, like, being all in on the grossness. You got ostracized if you were like, hey guys, you, you're, you know, going a little too far. You know, you were ostracized if, if you mentioned that you might be possibly offending people. And how easy it would be to just, you know, change a word or two and get the same meaning and then just not offend. Like, you, you would have been chased off. And within the last 20 years, that it's, it's like 180 for the better, I think. It uh, makes me appreciate. It makes me appreciate like whenever you meet somebody who's like 80 years old and they're like, "Man, things have just changed so much." And you're like, "Yeah, Grandpa, it's called inventing cell phones." But in just my short time alive, I've seen the zeitgeist and just human behavior on the whole change for the better so drastically you know I don't think I could have a conversation with myself if I went back in time to when I was 20 I don't think I could talk to myself without just straight up punching the fuck out of that dude I would like to say that Christmas is over ho ho you never miss one of those you always no no I'm sorry I didn't mean to get, uh, start pouring out my heart there I'm glad, glad you're rolling me back in, Daddy. We can't follow nope. suit, so we're just gonna... <laughs> That's what Daddy is here for. <laughs> is it okay for me to tell you that I feel like I was, like, a pretty, like, balanced and rational and mature person at the age of 20 to where I... I won't believe you, but you can say that, yes. <laughs> <sighs> My knees! <laughs> All right. Oh, I was you going are... for an achievable number two. You are now there you a go. car. Can you beat the 900? Well, we can only find out by trying. Mm. Doing. He bells his shit and this is not hard points. I don't laugh so hard. Oh, nope, there he goes. All right, 32. Easy. Easy, easy. Oh. Easy. Easy, easy, easy. Look how easy that is. Easy peasy. Jesus Christ. Hey, you know, I'm, I'm not playing my character. That's that's the uh, that's the excuse. Alright. This is actually much tighter than the games we normally have. Yeah, full disclosure, Laura usually tears my ass up in these. I wasn't going to say that part, but... Oh, I didn't beat it, did I? Oh, I did. I, I played a lot of Horks uh, growing up as a kid. Me and uh, my brother Isaac grinded the shit out of 2022. Honestly, we grinded the shit out of the PS1 versions of, of the first four, but I like to pretend that I never... Uh, I like to pretend that three and four parts of my life didn't happen because those games are such compromises, piece of shit, you know? Oh! Get up there! Alright. Oh. So what's actually funny is I, I never played. I never had anybody to compete with, and it's actually a completely different mindset. Um, this isn't usually how I approach Tony at all. Um. Nice. You are a horse. You are a horse. All right. So, dude. No, no, no. 
Let's do one more video. Let's do one more video, different level, different word. Alright, I'll let you do that. <laughs> Alright, guys, uh, so tune in. Probably I won't make you wait two weeks for a second Tony Hawk video. <laughs> we'll see how lazy our editor is. Yeah. Get that hobo to work. <laughs>